so guys here is the flour here is what i'm going to use you can see it that is the flour okay guys now we are about to start first of all boil your water my water is already on the gas boiling so that is what i'm going to use but you have to check it if it's much you reduce it just like i'm about to do now the water you are going to use it later yeah you can use it later don't pour it away just keep it by the side because it's going to be used later then get ready to add your flour inside the boiling water my sister hey this pando is not that easy to make oh. hmm. if you are doing pando pounded yam you have to be very very careful because any slight mistake <laughs> it will become a stone oh hey it will be a story for another day <laughs> and you cannot you can't even manage to swallow it it will just be a wasted effort so you just have to be careful that's why a lot of people don't really like doing this pando they prefer doing the easier one like like um semo and other now transfer it to the other side of the gas or you off the current gas just transfer it to the other side of the gas so that you can turn it very very well without getting burns then after you might have turned it very very well you can take it back and cook it once again it's getting thicker at this point and becoming more harder if you cannot turn it on top of the gas you can bring it down why anger <laughs> then uh, if you know how you can turn it very well just turn it like that so you can stand up you can sit down just make sure you turn it very very well that's what i mean so now you can add your saved hot water then start turning it again as you are turning it you'll be like if it's not okay you can still add another water like i'm going to use all the water that i kept here i'm going to use if not the pando yam will become so strong like okute <laughs> so you have to make it to to be soft so that anybody can eat it you have to make it to be so soft yeah nah man turning this thing is not easy okay now i'm about to take it back i have to add the last hot water then take it back to the to the side and um, yeah so that it can cook my gas is still on yeah don't be tired of turning you know. <laughs> this pando yamu the work is too much it's not something that <clears throat> anyway personally i don't do it always i only use pando maybe when i have a special visitor <laughs> maybe when i have a special visitor or maybe when i want to surprise hobby like do the pando yam with a goosey soup or with um onubo soup like bitter leaf yeah in fact this pando is just for a special day if i'm in a good mood if not ah please oh i don't get strength in fact this pando should be a man's work honestly <laughs> hey whoa yes <yeah>, so <laughs> they say what a man can do i woman can do it anyway that is what i am doing now. <laughs> all right um if you are looking for shape or oh, if you want to slim down you are not advised to eat pando now i am adding the last water and uh, after adding this water now i have to allow it to cook for some time yes yeah just close the pot then allow it to after cooking it for like five minutes come back oh, don't forget you have something on fire maybe you are pressing your phone <laughs> okay now the last turning this this is the last turning hey chimo mm, i need more can somebody get more for me because this turning turning no day is you hmm. my hands are paining me already but anyway i'm just here to teach you guys after this so maybe the next time i will do this pando should be next month <laughs> i'm telling you honestly the next time she'll be next month is not this one. Eh? 
Yes, so as you can see, the food is done. Yeah, mm. so smooth. So, so smooth. Are you seeing that? Are you seeing that? Not just smooth, but soft. Smooth and soft. <laughs> I can't wait to download this thing. Hmm. After downloading, tomorrow I have to go jogging. <laughs> yes, so my food is ready, guys. Share this video, share this video. I have done my part. Do your part by sharing to others. Subscribe. I have done my part. Do your part. Oh.